For over 20 years, the Thomas Wooden Railway has continued to put smiles on millions of children throughout the world. Over the last couple of decades, hundreds of Thomas's friends and rolling stock have been released. Many of these only lasted for a short while, and others have survived the test of time since day one. Join me every Friday as we spotlight one character a week. This is Character Friday. Hey guys, this is Mike Mike One Two Three here. Just here to remind you that every Friday is a care um well before I was rudely interrupted by myself I was gonna say every Friday is a character Friday have a good day everybody. hey everyone welcome back to another character Friday today we're gonna be taking a look at a friendly yellow crane named Kevin we were first introduced to Kevin in the movie Hero of the Rails. Although Kevin gave a sort of a clumsy impression at first, as the movie unfolded you got to see what a kind hearted fella he is during Hero's restoration. Based on a ransom and rapier 6 ton crane with an additional enclosed cab, Kevin works in the Sodor Steamworks alongside Victor. Always willing to lend a hand or a hook, his intentions are always true, but at times his clumsiness causes him a slip of the hook. Some features that you may notice about Kevin is that he has a red hook and he also has some black and yellow warning stripes around his face and on his sides. And he is also accompanied with a Sodor shipping freight cargo piece with his new wooden railway model. Seen since season 13 in the television series and also in multiple movie specials, Kevin has been anything but absent since being introduced, which sadly isn't the same for most new characters. One thing that I would have to say about Kevin is that I just picked up this new wooden railway version of him and he's mostly made out of plastic, which I'm willing to overlook if the product is of an exceptional quality, but I've got to say that this particular Kevin was downright terrible. Terrible. While reviewing him, his crane broke after about an hour of filming, and I was quite disappointed. I was going to chalk it up about Kevin being a clumsy character, but had a child played with this, the playtime would most likely not have even lasted a whole hour. Aside from that sad model, I will say that for the character Kevin, I'm not too fond of his personality, as his clumsiness seems to distract me more than anything. I'm really curious to see what your thoughts are about Kevin. Thanks for watching, and remember that every Friday's a Character Friday.